Okay, this might seem familiar because this is uh, Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Grader? But apparently multiple Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Grader games were made for the Wii. For whatever reason, I guess they were that successful. And this is a different version of Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Grader for the Wii. There's no previous save data. It, it is a different game because we did play Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Grader before. Usually I wouldn't play the same game like this again, but this version of Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Grader lets you play with your me. The other one that I played first didn't. You had to create a character. It was just, it wasn't as intuni intuitive. We can finally put Beef Boss to the test. Is Beef Boss smarter than a fifth grader? Oh, look at this. We can change what he wears. Maybe this light color like that. I'm not the best fashion sensible guy. So we're just going to go with that. Are you smarter than a fifth grader? I don't know the words besides that. At least James isn't in this version of Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Grader? He screwed me last time. I was about to win a million dollars. Look at Jeff Foxworthy dance. Look at those moves. And Beef Boss's moves. Katie, Nate, or Bob? How about Bob? Bob is the name of my grandpa. Alright, Bob. I want to pick you. Get your ass over here, Bob. Oh, classmates' favorites. Astronomy and languages. Alright, vocabulary is a language. Which of the following words means to no longer have? Okay, well, all right, well, I, I, I'm, I'm going to say lose on this one. Bob, if you got that one wrong, you're really dumb. You got that one right. Oh, thank you, Jeff. Way to go, Beef Boss. You did it. Okay, let's do math. Math is probably going to be the hardest. Oh, yeah, it is because it's fifth grade math. How do we express five and three quarters as a decimal? Are you kidding me? That's freaking easy as hell. You won yourself $5,000. Yeah, well, yeah. that wasn't very hard. Bob, why is Bob cheering? Bob's not giving any of my fucking money. If I win, this is all on me. I'm not asking Bob for any help. All right, let's do art. Let's get these hard ones out of the way. George's Surat is, a fam is most famous for his picture of what subject? Oof. Buildings, people, water, or stars. Okay, now this one. Now this one is ridiculous. Alright, let's peek. Yeah, I want to peek. What What did Beef Boss just say? Okay, Beef Boss just say. Bleh, 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 bleh. Okay. Oh, he says people. Alright. Well, Bob, I get to blame you if you get it wrong at least. Ooh! Alright, Bob. I'll give you $5. I'll buy you McDonald's. All right. The hard ones are out of the way. Let's go to Astronomy. Triton, one of Neptune's moons, orbits Neptune in... Who the fuck learns this in the fifth grade? Fourth grade? Who the hell learns this in the fourth grade? I barely learned my freaking very eager mother just ordered us nine pizzas, but now it's not even nine pizzas. It's just nine. Polar... Erratic. Well, I'm guessing it's not polar and not erratic. It's got to be counterclockwise or clock. I'm just going to risk it all. Clockwise. It's clockwise. You were sweating a little bit on that one, but you're correct. Oh, yes! That's right! I know your new moons, Neptune. What is the Spanish word for year? Año. Oh, my God. Good thing all that Spanish in high school paid That's off. I'm about to be smarter than a fifth grader on my first try. Or actually, Beef Boss is. Beef up. Boss gets the credit for this one. We got all the hardest ones out of the way. Honestly, drama might be pretty bad, though. Which of these terms describes the highest point of dramatic tension? Often the turning point of the play. Or oh, the climax. It's also the, the part of most tension during intercourse. But these fifth graders probably don't know that yet. Or they actually, they probably do. Fifth grade's about when you figure that out. All right, Katie. I have no choice but to have your ass help me. If you blow this for us, I'm going to be mad. Which of these words is spelled collect correctly? Agreeable. Okay, well, um, I know this one. That's the right answer. Thank you. <laughs> nice laugh, Beef Boss. You are part Mario. The Baltic Sea borders what other body of water? Second grade world geography. Are you fucking me right now, Jeff? Jeff, there, there is no way 
I can pull or pull 10,000 second graders and like maybe two of them will know this answer. I need to copy. Katie, I swear to God, if you screw me on this one, I'm telling your mom and you're never going to eat again in your life. Okay, there it is. Your answer's locked in. I swear to God, Katie. You've won yourself $1,000. Oh, thank you, Katie. Which is a fairy tale by... What's with these second grade questions being so ridiculous? Hans Christian Andersen. Rumpelstiltskin. The ob like, it's got to be the freaking ugly duckling. Come on. That's the only thing that makes sense for a second grader. Thank you. Thank you, Jeff. Okay, this should be the easiest question. It's the penis. Which of the following is about the same size as your heart? Well, look, I knew the answer before I even saw the question. A watermelon, a golf ball, a football, or a closed fist? I don't see my wiener as an option, but I'm going to go with the next best thing. Wow, we did it. Okay, so I'm already smarter than a fifth grader. One game in. Potential winnings. Bonus question. Animal science. All right, let's go for it. The pre-dinosaur ancestors of the mammals, therapicids, combined features of mam mammals in what other type? Oh, fucking whores. We're going to guess amphibian, but I don't know how to spell it. Well, I don't know if that's how you spell it, but... Wait, no, no, no. Wait, hold up. Search. What does this search do? This is like a Google search? I don't get it. How about reptiles? Reptiles is an easier word to spell. Oh, look at that actually pops up. So that that's probably an answer. That's going to be retarded. <laughs> is that really how you feel, right, Beat Boss? locked in. We need to. <laughs> we need to put beef boss in a. We did it! Uh oh my goodness! Beef boss, we need to send you to like some speech impediment school or something. We just won a quarter of a million dollars and beat the game in one try. As beef boss, and he's really happy. Well, I have really proven myself today. Well, I guess we're going to have to play a different mini or type of game mode. In Classroom Clash, four players are pit against each other, trying to answer a question as quickly as possible. What is Texas? A state. Okay, I'm I'm clicking. State! Well, how am I supposed to select the answer? <laughs> it's not letting me. Someone thought Texas was a motherfucking country. The box of crayons thought it, Texas was a country. Oh, you hit it on your D-pad. Apple is a freaking smart ass. Freaking box of crayons is an idiot. They didn't even know. What is the correct spelling for a statue that... How can you read the question that quick, pencil? That celebrates a person's accomplishments. Monument. Which country's cuisine includes enchiladas, guac... Oh, freaking Mexico. Wait, is it not Mexico? It's definitely not Canada. Oh, it's Mexico. Freaking box of crayons thought it was freaking Portugal. Colors that are closest together on the color wheel are called what? Analogagas. Of course, box of crayons should get this question. Considering it's about colors. Box of crayons is an idiot. They didn't get that right. An oyster is a member of which phylum? Mollusk. Oh, no, no, no. It's crustacean. I got it wrong. It was a mollusk. In Egyptian mythology, who was the goddess of truth and justice? It's got to be Matt. Matt is always the goddess of truth and justice. <laughs> it was. I had no idea. I just guessed Matt because of Matt. All right, let's see if Matt is smarter than a fifth grader. This is probably something that we've all thought about. How smart is Matt? We know how good Matt is at sports, but how smart is he? Matt just looks so pissed off to be there. Which of the following phyla would you not find in an intertidal zone? Well, this is a question and a half. Which of the following phyla, don't know what that is, would you not find in an intertidal zone? Your classmate I have a, is locked in. Thanks, Jeff. I have a feeling that has something to do with the ocean, but I don't know where the intertidal... So I'm guessing that's where the tide, like at high tide, there's water. At low tide, there's no water. That's the intertidal zone. 
So which of the following phyla? Arthropoda, there's definitely like those arthropods. That's like crabs and shit, I think. I don't know what phyla means, so that I could just be completely wrong. Zygomycota. They just do not seem to, to belong there. I don't think they belong in that intertidal zone, Jeff. You just won five thousand. That's what I was thinking. There ain't no way a phyla that starts with the letter Z lives in an intertidal zone. I can't believe my logic on that one worked. Which city lies farthest west? Phoenix, Arizona. Reno, Nevada. Reno has to be. Boise, Idaho. Or Los... Oh, come on. Los Angeles. Obviously. Come on. Don't insult my intelligence like this. Nope. Sorry. What? <laughs> and what was that noise, Matt? You got your save, so if your classmate is right, All right, you'll still Clifton. Be on. Clifton. See. You better have got it. Oh well, you can't win them all. Why would you guess Idaho, Clifton? <laughs> oh, well, okay. How is Hold up. Show us the correct answer, please. It's got to be Reno. How the fuck is that more east or west, though? Pick another subject. No, no, no. No, 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 Jeff. How the hell is a Los Angeles, California not as far west as L Reno, Nevada? Oh, we're splitting hairs here, Jeff. We are splitting hairs. What kind of fifth grade geography? That is such a trick question. Yeah, shut up, Jeff. I'll take as long as I fucking want, you dickhead. 86 miles. It's 86 miles more west than Los Angeles. That's like nothing. In the scale of our entire country, that's like a hair. 86 miles is a hair. The United States? How many miles across is the U.S.? The U.S. is 2,800 miles. We're talking 3% here, Jeff. 3%. What relevance does that have? I don't know. But that is a trick question, a stupid question, and you're splitting hairs. Literally, a th it, it, who, who the fuck even cares? That's a stupid question. No one, no one in my fifth grade class or my fifth grade teacher or fifth grade classmates, no one ever said, you know, try to trick me. Oh, what's further west, Reno or Los Angeles? Yeah, no one, no one, no one asks that question. No one points that out. What is the Spanish word for jump? Sprung. Uh, I don't think so. I think it's saltar. I mean, verbs all have like an AR at the, at the end, I think. That is correct. correct. Yeah, don't, the second you try to convince me that it's gonna be wrong if you do that fake wrong thing i know jeff you're not fooling me so there's a homosexual phone that has interest in right i would think that left has a sexual attraction for right the other answers just don't make sense so i'm just gonna go left and this is a first grade reading question so i'm hoping they're not throwing me a loop here that's not <laughs> <laughs> First grade! First motherfucking grade! <laughs> what? What's the correct answer? Oh. Oh, that would make sense. There, so okay, I, I guess I didn't I guess I didn't say that one through, so I really didn't under I I should have said all the answers out loud, then I probably would have understood what, what they were asking. I didn't even think right is the same as right. I don't I don't know. I just thought that left was gay for right, so. I don't know the answer on this one. I'm just gonna copy my freaking teammate. Frick that. That's gonna be my choice. <laughs> We're gonna do our stupid mumble and copy our teammate. Pantomime, sure. Mime makes sense. Mime, okay, no words. See if you're right. Right after these messages. Oh, no, nah, wait, I'm just kidding. Oh, you. Thank you, Anna. Ha 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 ha. When what did we just say? Keiku Ana? What is this? Some anime shit? What did we just say? Matt, you're embarrassing us on the stage. In front of everybody. Oh, well, uh, we only have 500 bucks, but we could win 5,000, so we're gonna go for it. 
What is a 12 letter word used to describe something that may cause cancer? <laughs> what? A 12 letter word used to describe something that may cause cancer. Cancerous. It is cancerous, isn't it? C A N C E R O U S. No, that's not enough letters. Ah, oh, 12 letter word. Oh no, I didn't put anything! <laughs> I forgot to put an answer! I didn't even read them. I know I asked the question a long time ago, but your answer still isn't right. <laughs> it sounds like a plane crashing, like a freaking stupid plane crashing. I'm sorry, but you have flunked out of school. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> The These noises is... are too much. Okay, I would have, I would have never got that one. I was just gonna put dildos in ass, but I, I accidentally just hit locked in. Goodbye, everybody. We'll see you again next. Was that us saying we are not smarter than a fifth grader? Before you go, I need you to tell the entire world that you are not smarter than a fifth grader. And now we're just gonna dance it off. Dance it off, all cool. Well, Matt. Matt fucked that one up pretty hard. Beef Boss has the brains on the Wii. I can't skip this. I just have to. I just. We just have to watch it. And Matt's still excited. We still got a C plus out of that. Oh well, that's probably enough. Are you smarter than a fifth grader for this time? This game honestly wasn't really the only thing different about this game is there's less classmates you get to pick from. You get to be your me, and that's about it. But Beef Boss is, in fact, smarter than a fifth grader, but Matt is not. And I'm done now.